right guys, hey listen, this is pretty simple, uh, but it sounds really awesome. It uses suspensions, and I'm going to give you the intro to come, now is the time to worship, and then I'll give you the strumming pattern. First of all, I'm going to break the intro down for you very slowly in this video. So, the intro sounds like this. Listen how it sounds. You've probably heard it, but it goes... Alright, so that's the intro. Let me break it down for you. I'm going to scoot up here to Tad. I'm going to show you that basically we're using D chord, a D2 chord, and a D4 chord. Okay, so you need to learn those suspension chords first. D, okay, and then D2, and then D4. And then also you need to know your palm mute. So you know that if you're my gold student, you can look at the palm mute video or you've been palm muting. So, um, now you notice I'm doing a little bit of accent. But I want you to learn this song slow and straight. Straight rhythm, all downs, and slow. It goes like this when it sounds like that. Again, one and two and three and four and oh, two, three, two, two, oh. Okay, so. So it goes two 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 o oh, two. And I'm just playing all down. So basically, you can do that with your single finger, like I just did, or you can. You really need to be doing it with your chord. But to learn it, you can do the single finger. And then when you do this, you're just lifting up this finger, putting this finger down, putting your pinky down, going to two, going to open, going to two, going to four, going to two, going to D. This, these are your suspension chords. So you should play regular D, then you should open up so you got the high E string open. And then you should play regular D again. And then you should play four just by putting your pinky down. And then you can play that intro very slowly, like this. Okay, once you get that intro very slowly, then you can add the rhythm pattern of the verse to this. So, learn that very slowly, and then the rhythm pattern of the verse goes one and two and three and four. It's a syncopated rhythm, and we're going to learn that in the strumming pattern. Once you get it, then you can add it to this, like going like this. And that's how you're going to do it. So check out the strumming pattern rhythm, and then apply it to that.